Good morning, old friends. I'm back. This week, I am embarking on the pizza challenge. That means pizza, three meals a day for seven days. Pizza number one is gonna come from Society Kitchen. Um, can I please do your breakfast pizza? Pizza, 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 pizza. I'm gonna eat the pizza today and tomorrow and all the rest of the days. Mm-hmm, mm. They're pretty good. I found a lunch, buddy. Just Cleo. I want a fat salad for lunch. I'm gonna have a fat pizza for lunch. Pizzana in Brentwood. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner for seven days. Seven days. Seven days. Just pizza. Just pizza. I love this food. lesson don't eat more than one slice at a time so I'm technically lactose intolerant and I forgot to buy lactate so my belly really hurts really bad things are happening to my belly right now Walking into Rite Aid so I don't poop my pants during this challenge. Excuse me, where's the lactate? Pizza delivery! stomach ache and I'm gonna eat cold pizza for breakfast because I'm too lazy to go get breakfast pizza. Um, freshly toasted bottom, cold burrata on top, green tea and pizza mug. I'm trying to stick to the one slice roll today because yesterday I failed miserably. What a good leftover. Lunch pizza. Salad on a pizza. I don't know how to eat this. Mm. So good. I have an everything bagel pizza crust. At W Pizza at Terminal 6 at LAX. I'm gonna mix the Tabasco in the ranch to dip the pizza in. Pizza is my carry-on item. I hope he doesn't mind. Breakfast pizza in Chicago. Whoa. 10 51. And I haven't eaten anything because there's no breakfast pizza in Chicago. Back at the airport, about to get on a four-hour flight, and I need pizza for the plane. Yeah. Chicago airport pizza was definitely a low. That was gross. Normal belly, pizza belly. Normal belly, pizza belly. I really like this weird Swedish pizza all I ordered. What kind of pizza is this, Bob? It's Swedish. It tastes like soap. What's wrong? You don't like soap? I don't like soap! Help me. I just woke up and I pooped. <laughs> Pizza poop. Thank God. It's been days. Back in LA. Gonna go to Milo and Olive. They're apparently famed 
for the breakfast pizza. Remember I feel like the yo. Hey, what's up? He's a Chick Fil A. I know. Oh, he's pizza's jealous. crazy. Do you think pizza or Chick Fil A is harder? I just came to Taco Bell to pay homage wow, to my old friend, and I'm gonna get a Mexican pizza because that kind of counts. I'm back. Bye. Oh damn. Not really pizza, but whatever. <laughs> Do you think Taco Bell's Mexican pizza counts as pizza? Yeah. No, probably not. Yes, but it's tough. It's a, <laughs> that's a really, that's a loose, loose definition of pizza. Huh? I don't. It has cheese in a pot. I'm so curious. Are people pizza and wine people or pizza and beer people? This is going to be 27. 27 pieces of pizza in four days. It's like college all over again. Minus the keg stands. Day five, which means I'm almost done. I'm gonna go to Whole Foods to see if they have some sort of pizza bite thing. I think pizza bagels count as a breakfast food. I'm on a witch hunt for some ranch. Okay. Oh, it's out. It's out for delivery. Ranch and garlic sauce. Domino's pizza looks pretty tasty to me. How to create the perfect Friday evening. Brought to you by Tastemade. Step one, take out. Step two, a little bit of spice. Oh. Step three, a beautiful bottle of Italian red. Step four, find a friend. Step five, relax. Saturday morning, day six. I'm having leftovers. Watching Gilmore Girls. Even if I was the Billy Carter of the family, the name is still supposed to carry some weight. Surprisingly very good for day two pizza. I'm going to Lodge Bread Co. to have some pizza. I was told it was very good, so we'll check it out. Let's see if it tastes as good as it smells. Only four more to go. I don't have any of my next meals planned out, so time to get a little spontaneous. I'll probably just go to Costco. I think I've been put in a pizza coma. I've been sleeping for three hours. I can't, I can't go on. Damn. It's room temperature at best. It's not the best. How do you know? You Look at how sad that is. How would you heat this up if you had to? Toaster oven. You don't have a toaster oven. I don't know. You got pizza in your hat. I do? Yep. Can you get it out? Nope. Please. Nope. Please. Just <laughs> shower or something. Since I can't work out because of the, the bruised tailbone, uh, my girlfriend is bringing me to Shape House, which is a place where you sit in a room and sweat for an hour. This is just all sweat. Pizza whew, sweated out of my body. Hopefully it works and my throw up pizza. Are you proud of me? I've never been proud of you. Are you more proud of me now or when I get Taco Bell? It's just so hard to tell. The most of huge accomplishments. Thanks guys for following along on yet another 